Ghana's leading consulting firms, Akintola Williams Deloitte, has come out with a sector-wide position paper on the ailing Nigerian economy with a focus on micro, small and medium-scale enterprises, SME. MSMEs, that is. At the presentation of the paper into the Nigerian Association of MSMEs, the management of the firm called for a policy revision and a friendly tax regime. The management team of Akintola Williams, the Lord, members of the Nigerian Association of Small and Medium Enterprises, NASMI, stakeholders from the Small and Medium Enterprises Development Agency of Nigeria, as well as other business policy advocates, are here to chart a course for the future and stability of small businesses in Nigeria. I must see him stand up and speak and feel rejuvenated. After much deliberations, Akintola Williams Deloitte presents its position paper to the management of NASMI. Akintola Williams Deloitte says part of its recommendations are solutions to the challenges faced by MSMEs in Nigeria, bridging tax regulatory gaps, and a favorable fiscal policy from the federal government. The big boys are the ones controlling the marketplace. The small business always have it as a challenge to penetrate the market. So if anything government can do to alleviate the, the, the constraints for SMEs to access the market, it's very welcome. Also capacity building is another issue because most SMEs are not properly structured, structured as it were, and they will need the support of government agencies you know, to build capacity. And not quite satisfied, they ask for more. You can also look at amnesty in terms of waivers, waiving penalties and interest. And so you only limit the, the, the taxpayer to making payment on the principal tax liability across a defined uh, period of time. That is what the tax amnesty that we are advocating is about. Invariably, Nigeria's economy is largely driven by MSMEs. And with about 96% of businesses falling under this category, players in this industry can be optimistic that policymakers will give some attention to the needs of this critical sector.